Hello fellow engineers and welcome back to Diplomacy is not an option. I am this dude over here and I decree that we are going to build some more cities and defend it. Okay, says this guy. I also realized as well this... <laughs> this na I thought that was the name of the save that I was playing. But no, apparently that's my username in game. So, oops. This is my adorable Labrador puppy Paddy. Unfortunately, he's not for sale. However, this is... This is the limited edition Paddy plushie. They're only available for a very limited time. So if you want your own, be sure to head to the link in my description where you can buy it from the website. Any that do not get purchased may be destroyed by Paddy himself. So this is your chance to save a Paddy plushie. <laughs> anyway, but this is where we got to. Lo what the hell has happened there? What? <laughs> that wasn't there before, was it? A big old lump of stone has appeared. <laughs> and a load of deer's asses. What? Oh, what? Can I actually mine these? Not today. I need more people. Right, anyway. I was going to hit pause and we're going to see where we got to last time. So we built a load of houses already. You can see our population growth is 105 per day. So we're almost going to double our population come tomorrow. Food consumption is pretty high. 144. I assume that's only going to go up when we get more people. But over here we are building more fishermen's huts. We can grab some fish nado and eat them. Uh, what's that little symbol? Not enough fish. Oh no! We've depleted the fish! Ooh, I didn't know that was a thing. So, we got to be careful here then. I assume I can delete them. I get six wood back. Okay, I'll take that. But yeah, we do need some more food. So I'm just going to quickly build a few berry picker huts through next to all these little berries that we haven't harvested yet. All right, so hopefully that will sort the food situation. Maybe I need to build some more fishman huts up here. Oh man, I didn't realize food depleted. It makes obvious sense, but <laughs> I think the trouble is I went a bit overboard on the houses. All right, down here, is this storage full? Storage is full. Oh god, right. Which means they're taking stone all the way over to that one. So I'm going to build some more stone storage. Oh, we could actually do storage too. We unlocked that with our town hall upgrade. It's 60 wood and 10 stone. We have 600 wood and 200 stone. So yeah, I think we'll build that. That can just go next to it. I might build a granary over here just to store all of our fish. Seems like a good idea. Oh, and perhaps a market. So then we can exchange resources. So obviously we're cutting down a lot of wood and we're using a lot of food. Yeah, maybe I'll build one of them. Oh, look at it. Look how colourful it is. Not that that matters. So I'm an engineer. I just care about it being efficient and stuff. Uh, next up, perhaps some more builder's huts. Because there aren't many people building at the moment. Probably plonk a couple down there. Oh, I probably should have just done the upgraded one. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> and then a hospital. We definitely need a hospital because the last war we did at the end of last episode was pretty brutal. So I reckon we'll just plonk that there behind the castle. Uh, I might start mining some iron. We haven't done any of that yet. So I think we'll plonk an iron mine in there. Maybe another one down there. I'll do more storage by those mines just because they're traveling really far. You can see there's like a conga line of resources. Oh, is that iron? The blue stuff. But yeah, if they don't have to travel as far, then we can mine quicker. So that's all good. And they'll probably put some of this wood in as well. All right, and then it might be worth upgrading our barracks as well. That costs 30 wood and 50 stone. Stone, but then we can build loads of new troops. So yeah, I've done that. And next off, we're gonna take these archers and we're gonna we're gonna go get some soul crystals because we used a lot of death rays at the end of last episode, meaning we've only got one soul crystal left. And I think they're sort of the key to surviving the waves of incoming attacks. Oh god, there's a lot of people here. Oh god, they're all coming, they're all coming. We might have to retreat. Yeah, sod this. Leg it, leg it, boys. <laughs> all right, that's far enough. Now attack. Now back. Right, that's it. Take him down. No, they killed one of us. But let's try and snipe these guys. There we go. Hopefully you can take them down before they get close with their pitchforks. Okay, now we take down the building. That's dropped a soul crystal. Lovely. But now we need to defend ourselves. That was so many arrows into that one plague. We're looking at another building to destroy. Right, we're losing some troops. But uh, we got another soul crystal. I think if we go into these, we get a load of free resources. Yes, we gain some food. Although food is still a massive issue. Oh god. All right, let's up the builder hut priority because then we can build faster. They're both top priority now, so they're getting built instantly. All right, and then we're not going to attack those. There's a bit too many. I think we're going to head back. Now, down here, you can see the enemy will attack on day 20. It's currently day 17, or night 17, so it will be day 20 pretty soon. I probably want to think about trying to up my defenses, uh, or maybe food first. Like, food food ain't good. We're consuming 360 a day. I right, tell you what, we're just going to have to build up here, which I think means sending another army to join these guys and then we're gonna have to take out all of that and perhaps we'll try and wall around the back of it and then we'll be fully walled almost let's just go through the trees 
surprise attack. Ready? Charge! Right, that's one down. Another crystal in the bag. Go okay, pick that up, boys. And then just defend yourselves. Oh man, there's a lot of enemies. There are a lot of enemies. But the Spider-Man swordsmen are actually doing the deeds. Fair play, guys. Although some of these little peasants, they have shields now. They've evolved. All right, we'll just explore this end, sort of uncover all the secrets of the darkness. Oh, now it's nighttime, so it's, it's proper darkness. This is advanced darkness. But I think that's pretty well covered. I am going to tell these graves people, go and pick up that dude, so I can just move where they look for dead bodies, because that is one of ours. Uh, oh, God. They got catapults. Run away. Run. What the hell? They got signs. Ow, they're catapulting us. All right, catapult. You're going to have to come join in. That's annoying. They have catapults, eh? All right, what I might do, I might send one lone Spider-Man in on his own. And hopefully he will distract the catapults. Oh, God. It's just instant. Oh, they got both of me. Oh, I just sent him to his doom. I'm sorry, mate. It's no fair when the enemies have catapults as well. Oh, they ruined my Spider-Man. Are you guys okay? They are actually okay. All right, what? Run away. Run away. Ow! Ow! <laughs> Their range is insane. Right. Not entirely sure what I'm going to do about that. Oh, bollocks. I've just noticed they're attacking in two minutes from up there. I don't have walls in that direction. Oh, God. Right, we've got to build some defenses. Although, look, look. Our new barracks are complete. We've got all these new members. So we've got a spearman, which could be tasty. We've got a healer. Oh, they can heal us. Okay. And a crossbowman. Nice. I've noticed our sort of storage is completely full. we got so much wood. So if I head to our lovely market. Oh, look at that. It's got like a proper airship on the top. Literally an airship. It's a boat. But let's open the market. Let's trade wood in return for food. So we can trade 300 wood for 150 food. That might cover us for a day. It's not going to, doing the maths. Uh, and that takes 50 seconds. So the Zeppelin is off. It's taking our wood and hopefully it will return with some food. All right, let's pause the game. We gotta we gotta build our defenses pretty quickly. Put a gate there. And then we wall over to there. Perhaps shove a tower in that corner just in case. Oh, what we might be able to do, actually. We might be able to build our wall over to there. Although I am worried about the catapults over that direction. But we could actually get away with that. A very small wall, I think. Yes, yes. Okay, that's going to work. That is going to work. As long as they don't come down that side of the river, we will be fine. So let's go back into here. Build stone wall. Shove a tower on each corner, perhaps. And I might just bung a watch watchtower behind just so i can see where they come from uh, next up defenses we're gonna build a catapult or two or six uh, crossbows have a higher shot range than archer okay so we may as well build a load of those do a load of spearmen and then we'll see what we need to do after that uh, it might be worth as well building some smaller defenses sort of back here just in case we have to fall back if we put a tower there you can sort of keep an eye on that i might move these guys behind the actually actually i need to build i need to build a gate there all right so the walls up here are nearly done good work builders so we'll take a load of archers and shove them on this gate i'm gonna grab one of these new crossbowmen and shove him on this watchtower oh god and they're attacking they are attacking thankfully defenses are going up let's grab our crossbowmen and our castle Catapults and we'll send them up this way. I'm going to put that catapult onto that tower just in case they come from that way. I really don't know what way they're going to come from. All right, these are nearly done. Let's grab a catapult. Shove one on there. Shove one on there. Oh, there's a catapult. Fire. Oh, no, they're coming that way. They're coming that way. No. <laughs> right, grab all these people. We got to go. We got to go this way. Balls. <laughs> all right, close the gate. Close the gate. Oh, that's a disaster. Oh, why didn't I see they're going to come from that direction? All right, we're going to fill the walls with archers. And then we're probably going to have to death ray pretty soon. There's so many people. <laughs> oh, it's never ending. The trouble is I've only got one death rate because they cost five. So I think I'm going to wait in case they have the old catapults. All right, looks like there's no, there's no catapults. I might death ray though there we go helping the boys out that's how we do it right and it looks like we survived the attack so let's open the gate we'll go grab those crystals because there are some buildings there that we just destroyed and nice we've done it i'm gonna grab a catapult and just shove one over there and then grab a crossbow guy and shove you up there and then i might just wipe out this place if we grab all of these people bring them up there all right let's send in the spider-men first feel like they should be a distraction and then we'll send in everyone else once they've gone there's a catapult here so we'll take some of you to destroy that 
Nice. And they've rushed the other one. All right, Catapult's down. There's a big giant. He is also down. Oh, God, there's a few more giants. But I think we should be okay. We've got loads of Catapults on our team. Although they're, they're not doing anything. Come on, lads. Get involved. All right, this little guy's doing some damage. So I'm just going to send a Spearman to take him down. But everyone else, you go take all this down. Go get those. Go get the crystals. Our Spearman didn't last long. I don't know if they're not very good or just giants are very good. But look how many crystals we're going to get here. There's so many crystals for days. All right, gobble them up. Two more over here. A bit of whatever that is. Is it wood? Yeah, I think it's wood. We've got more buildings up here to destroy. This is awesome. Loving this. Oh, I'll tell you what, if I could just do a wall across there. That would be perfect. So I can do a little wall there, a little wall there, and then just across that bit maybe, and then we're completely covered. I might actually tell them to build that now. Ah, no, I can't because that is beyond the boundary that we can build. I think we can only build up to that line, uh, which I guess means we just do a wall across like that, perhaps. Build some more fishermen's huts. I think I'm going to put fishermen huts all the way around. So even though this side isn't defended, it should be in range of everything, so it should be fine. All right, so where we tried to build all this stuff, you can see it's actually out of range. So I've just clicked on our builder's hut, and that's as far as we can build. We can use this button here to increase the worker's radius. So that's that's fine. I think I'll just do that for all of these. I can do the same for the castle as well. Sorry, the town hall. We are taking over the map in a big way. Can I do it for these graveyard people? That would be useful. Oh yeah, I can. I can just make them do everywhere. All right, we'll increase that. Because yeah, we've got we got a lot of dead bodies over here. Those knights, they're getting a bit stinky. As are these. Are they like builders that didn't make it, perhaps? All right, next up, I'm going to try and build a wall over here. So we'll try and move in this direction. Take out any enemies that we need to. Oh god, try and not get ill by walking through the dead spider-men. Hold your breath, boys. All right, nice. We can build a wall across there. That is good. Uh, Counselor, my lord, you may not have noticed, but we're short of food. Oh god, we are short of food. We got two food. We need 360. This is a disaster. So basically down here, I think we've Depleted some fish needles. So we may as well delete those. I might delete houses, you know. I feel like I got too many people, not enough jobs. Although it is handy, so I can just increase my army when required. Alright, so to upgrade our town hall, it says here 320 wood, 350 stone stone, eight iron. That's all fine. But then we need 10 gold. I don't have any gold yet. I don't even know how you get it. I wonder, perhaps in the market? Ah, look. Tap here to buy gold. I can trade things for gold. Okay, I mean, I really need food rather than gold. So yeah, let's try and get the food under control first. Just traded most of my stone for a load of food. I'm just gonna go mental with the berry pickers, I think. Oh, oh, but I've just noticed I can build a farm. It takes 18 seconds for each worker to produce two food and it holds four workers. Oh, I could just go mental on the farms. Yeah, let's do that. So we have a food crisis to fix. So you literally build the farm and then you surround it in fields. All right, that could be crisis averted. I might prioritize these over all the defenses. Oh, look how many workers we have left. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah, and then with the rest, I'm just going to go mental on the berry pickers. It's like there's loads of berries dotted about. We can probably do like one for each berry bush almost, or one for every two. All right, so that's that sorted. Food is now increasing, I think. The number's going up, so perhaps we're producing more than we're using? Don't know, but I've just planted like 40 berry picker huts, and we got all these farms coming, so I think food crisis might be averted. Oh, look, and there's our Zeppelin. It's coming back with our food. All right, I'll tell you what, it might be worth building a few of those archer tower huts, the watchtowers. We build one there, one there, one there. I'm sort of thinking like around the edge of all of our map just so we can see really far if anyone's going to attack. All right, yes, look at the food, look at the food. It's gone way up. Okay, that's the end of the night. I think we're actually pretty good now, although people are getting sick. Why are you walking through dead bodies, you idiot? Thankfully, we have a hospital, so she should be able to just go into that. Uh, day 27. So we've got three days until the next attack. If we can get everything walled up, I'll be pretty happy. It might be worth trying to take these guys out for good as well. I'll tell you what, let's, in our market, let's get some gold. I want gold. We may as as well sell maybe all of our iron. I don't think we're using iron for anything. Yeah, sod it. Let's sell iron. We'll get 24 gold. We can always put more iron mines in if needed. All right, let's grab all these guys and say, come over here. Oh, how did they get in? How did they get in? How did they get in? This is meant to be all walled up now. Well, that's a little bit worrying. Right, the Zeppelin has arrived, which means we now have gold. We've got 24 gold. So we can upgrade our castle soon. I am very tempted to try and unlock this meteor. I need the great obelisk. In order to do that, it looks like I need to knock down my simple obelisk because I can only build one of these at a time. Oh, I, I can build that straight away. Right, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Right, obelisk, you are coming down. It seems such a shame. But there she goes. She's down. Oh, no, we can't do it till we're level three. Oh, I'm an idiot. 
I am an idiot. We need 80 iron. Okay, not my finest move. Not my finest move. I may as well build the next one up anyway. There it is. All right, I'm just putting archers in those watchtowers that I built. You can see nice and far. All right, there you go. Look, the attack is going to happen from this direction, which means they're either coming from that side or this side again. So I think we're probably okay. I'm going to research some sturdy concrete as I've got loads of stone to use up. I won't bother finishing those walls. I th think we'll just take our army over here and sort of prep them. I'm not sure what side we want to be on. Maybe another tower like there could be good. Do I want any more towers up here? Maybe two more. I got loads of catapults, so I may as well use them. And then we got 31 people if we want to increase our army size. I might add a few healers, maybe five of those, just to see what they're like. And then I'll do the others as and when. Thankfully, the army builds really quickly. All right, so three seconds, they are attacking. And then I'll decide which side I want to put my catapults on. So I got two spare towers here. I've got two spare towers up there once they're built, of course. Oh, I've just noticed we've got enough resources to upgrade our town hall. So I may as well do that because I want the next obelisk. All right, keeping an eye on the trees. Where are they going to come from? I'm going to guess it's that wall. But I don't know for sure. All right, the healers are now built. So we'll grab them. Say, come up here. Aha, look, there they come. Right, catapults, get on there. We're going to close the gates because they're currently open. And then we'll just watch them get absolutely annihilated. Oh, I love to see it. Love to see it. I'm not too sure that I'm going to have to need my astral ray. It depends how many people are coming. It is sort of never ending. But the catapults really are doing the damage. Oh man, there's so many people. It's never ending. All right, do you think I have time to demolish that and build the new tower. No, I don't think we do. But that is the last of the troops, it looks like. Oh, some of our walls are taking a bit of damage. Do I astral raid to help out? I think they're coping. They're definitely getting smaller. The trouble is, a lot of our arrows aren't going very far. <laughs> I'll tell you what, I might open the gates and then we'll just send these guys through. Sod it. Alright, we're sending our troops out the walls because now our catapults, they should be able to get a good aim. Go on, fire. Boosh. Boosh. Love it. Oh, look. Our spearman can't die. He's got two mages, like, healing him constantly. And Spider-Man. Go on, boys. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Okay, quite a fan of them. Although this Spider-Man's getting hurt. No, he's healed again. He's healed again. Good work, team. That was fantastic. This game started off so hard, but I feel like we've just about hit a point where we're ahead. I'll tell you what, I think we're gonna clear a bit of the enemies out. So we'll go up here, clear those guys, and then we might even head over there. It's about time we cleared those. They've been taunting us from the start. All right, so meanwhile, I think, what do we need for the simple obelisk? I think we need more... Oh no, we literally can just do it now. Right, okay. Demolish that obelisk, and then we'll build the great obelisk in its place, and then we have a meteor strike. I might actually build that there and then watch it grow in the most efficient shape ever nice although up here i am getting a bit annihilated there's loads of giants bloody hell uh, we might have to retreat they are kicking our ass retreat via the soul crystals look how many people they killed no they're killing our catapults oh this was stupid all right come on catapults turn shoot quick oh we got one they are mullering us oh, i've just aggroed those guys as well you idiot catapult <laughs> all right you're gonna have to run boys god Damn. Well, that was that was silly. Still, if we can get over here, we can get our walls to help out. There we go. There we go. Sorted. Okay. <laughs> oh, that was stupid, Matt. You idiot. Good news, though. This monument is now completed, which means we can use the meteor. Super exciting. I'm going to build a few more log shack things as well. Oh, look. Forester cabin. I can grow trees. Okay, I'm going to build a forester cabin up here, maybe. Oh, where's our engineer's guild? Is it that one? Yeah, okay. Because we can up grade that to get blisters and trebuchets, which will be very handy. Uh, but for now, I think it's time. Let's finish the wall, finally. Add another tower there. Perhaps another one there. And then that's our entire kingdom walled up. Although this side is pretty weak. It's just wood and there's no towers. But we can we can fix that pretty easily, I think. Just a case of upgrading. I think sell more wood for coins as well. 280 wood for 7 coins. That seems like a good deal, right? And we're going to start filling my towers with catapults. So I better build a few more catapults. And it's pretty much just a case of waiting to see where they're going to attack from. And focusing upgrading that side. Alright, so there it is. They're coming from the top left so up over this direction uh, not ideal because it means they could come that side or they could come this side and we don't really have any defenses over here i'm going to grab my new army i'm going to say come over here build some towers on that one and then probably build a tower or two over here just in case right, annoyingly we're being attacked from down here i think a couple of cheeky guys
guy is just down there. I'm just going to send in this archer just to deal with him. Boosh, you're dead. Actually, you're there. Go get those crystals. You might want to use them for our meteor strike in a second. All right, so the enemy is approaching. Let's get catapults on walls. Let's get archers on walls. I just hope they come down this way and not that way, really, because I haven't really prepared anything up here. I will put a catapult on there. It looks like they are coming this way, though. Yeah, we're good. Right, let's get some catapults on this big tower. Oh, and look at the army. It is huge. They're destroying my berry shacks like anything. But is it time to send in a meteor? Oh, look at the crosshair. It's huge. Right, ready? Oh, boy. <laughs> Whoa, that was amazing. Oh, God, hang on. My gates are open. Shut the gates. Shut the gates, you idiot. Look at all the bodies. All right, let's send in another meteor. Boosh. Oh, that was good. That was fun. All right, I think we can open the gates. We're safe. We are safe. All right, there we go. The final guy is down. We survived another day. <laughs> I really like that meteor. That was fantastic. We do need more soul crystals if we want to do it again, though. Uh, so maybe that will be our aim next time. Get as many soul crystals as we can. I feel like our base is pretty good. Food's not an issue. We're getting all sorts of resources. Yeah, fantastic. Let me know if you're still enjoying the game, guys. Boost your like button. But I'll catch you guys next time. Peace, love, and meteor strikes and medieval wars. <laughs> this game's getting crazier and crazier. Bye, guys.